Hi, Greg here. In the next few videos, I'll be reviewing this LEGO Creator set. This is set 31010, simply titled Treehouse. It's 356 pieces. This was released last year, which was 2013. And to be honest, this is probably my favorite Creator set that's come out in the last few years. I think this set's just so cool. I love the treehouse aspect of it. And there's so many little unique elements to this build that made it so cool. You can see how it looks there on the front. It's just, just an awesome set. And the great thing about these creator sets is a lot of them are three in one, which this one is. And I'll flip this around. You can see the other builds that come with this. Of course, there's the treehouse there, which you saw on the front. And that's going to be the first build that I review. This is the advanced build. And then the medium build is this right here. Just like a nice little cottage getaway thing beside the water. And then what they consider the quick build is this one right here. So because this is going to be kind of a long build and take a little bit of time to review each one of these, I'll do them in three consecutive videos. The first one that we'll be looking at will be the advanced build and that's what you'll see next. Here's the completed treehouse. As I mentioned earlier, this is considered the advanced build as you can see on the front page here. This turned out to be 75 pages of instructions, so quite extensive, and I think it turned out really awesome. This is, I haven't built the other ones yet from this set, but I do think this is going to be my favorite build. We'll start down here with the minifig. He's the little kid minifig. You may have seen him in my minifig Monday video from this week. And he's got a wagon, which was a kind of a neat little build. That was the first thing you built with this set. It's got a pizza inside of it, and he's got a walkie-talkie that he's walking with. So he's a, he's a cool little guy, and this is his treehouse. As you can see, the main part of the treehouse is the top part here where you can go inside. There's a bed in there, and then I don't know what that's supposed to be. Maybe just like a little storage unit inside there. There's also a spot up top that he can go into. The roof's not quite completed. There's a flag up on top that you can see. He's got some staggered windows in the front. Kind of gives it a idea of it just kind of being something that was built quickly by a kid, which I think is cool. And then the window over here. That window does open up. I like that feature. I don't have any windows like that. I like the tan that they used with that. Around the back there's another window. Not a whole lot to see there. But you can see a good portion of the tree and how it goes down through there. The tree at the bottom is actually made of two separate pieces. So it kind of creates the illusion like this thing's built out over the top of a tree and then this one's used for support. Of the neat little elements to this, the one that you can see that's moving right now, this is the uh, well bucket. There's water down here and there's also a toad that came with this. I don't have any Lego toads so I thought that was kind of neat. But the, the bucket goes in there and then you can crank this up and down and raise and lower that. And I thought that was a nice little feature. Uh, I always lost these when I was growing up, those pieces of string. So it's great to finally have that and I like that they have like a hook that came with it. And then over here, to protect against intruders, you have a bucket full of what I'm assuming to be water that you can dump on people that are coming up the ladder. And then there's also a feature with the ladder where it folds up by using this right here. You can fold this up and kind of keep it up out of the way by folding that in like so. And then moving that across. So if you're up in your treehouse, you can keep other people from going up in it, which I think is pretty cool. And then you can drop it down too. So I like that little feature to it. On the ground, there's a bunch of different rocks and things down here. Here's another feature right here, where inside there you have a hidden map. I think that's kind of neat. There's rocks and stuff all over the ground. I like these circular tile pieces that they included. Here's what I'm assuming to be a dog. I, I can't imagine being anything other than that. That was kind of a unique build. Just kind of a bunch of little pieces, kind of a micro scale build that turned into what, I'm appear what appears to be a dog. And then the tree itself I think looks pretty good. I like what they did with the sides where you have some texture going up everything. It looks really nice. And then with the bottom using slopes down there. I like the way that that kind of comes out so it looks like the tree has roots that are going into the ground. So that's pretty cool. And then around here they just put some extra detail on it with the green to make it look like there's leaves and stuff growing at the top of it. It's uh, sitting on just a base plate, pretty basic, and they use some different colors of green. I like the dark green that they used on this, and I really like the dark brown. There's some unique pieces that you don't really find too often, and I don't really have a whole lot in my collection, so that's good to add those in in case I ever want to build anything else out of this. Up here, you can see he has like a little telescope to look out of, and there's a platform out there to stand on, so it's not just the interior section, it's also outside. And I think going around this, I think I pretty much covered everything about it. 
of everything there is to see. I mean, the, the, it really is an extensive set. I, I really like the way this looks. I picked this up for a total of $23.99 on Amazon. Its original price was $30. And I think for what it is, for 356 pieces, it turned into a really nice set. It was a nice build. My wife and I built this together, and we had a lot of fun building it. Uh, like I said, one of my favorite sets from last year, I think, in terms of Creator. There's so much with this. And I'm really excited to make the next builds. I'm probably going to go... Next build, we'll say, we'll we'll do go from the advanced and we'll go into the medium build. So that'll be the next one you'll see on the channel here. And that is the set 31010 Treehouse. Awesome creator set, 3-in-1. Stay tuned again for the next video. And we'll finish the reviews up on this by building the last two builds. So thanks for watching.